What's up guys, JB2017 here bringing you my very first Advanced Warfare Multiplayer Tips and Tricks video and today I'm going to show you an awesome tip that I doubt many of you knew before you clicked on this video and it is how to speed reload in the multiplayer. So let's quickly hop into a firing range and talk about it. So what is a speed reload? Well obviously it makes you reload quicker than normal but it's also at the sacrifice of wasting some bullets. So I'll explain that in a second. First off, let's just pretty much nail down what normal reloading is in the game. So right now, I'm going to shoot 10 bullets. Actually, let's shoot 20. So I have 10 bullets in my magazine. You can tell in the bottom right, 10 bullets in the magazine, 90 in reserves. I just click the reload button, X on Xbox, square on PlayStation, and I have 30 in my magazine, 70 in reserves. That was no change in total ammo. So I had 10 plus 90, that was 100. 30 plus 70 is 100. So there's no change in total ammo. All you're doing is moving ammo from your reserves into your actual magazine. So in order to speed reload, you double tap the reload button at any time when you've you know, shot bullets out of your magazine. So let's go ahead and shoot. This first time it may mess up, but just for example, here's double tap reload. You can tell that that was quicker, but my ammo count, uh, you know, it increased, the reserves increased because we're in a firing range. So let's do that one more time. I'm gonna shoot down to 20 bullets in my magazine, 180 in reserves. So if I double tap reload to speed reload, I had 200 total. I had 20 plus 180. Now I have 30 in my magazine, 150 in reserves. That's only 180 total. So by doing that, I lost out on 20 bullets. To demonstrate that again, let's do it one more time. So I have 170 total, I quick reload. Now I only have 150 total. So what that does is however much ammo you have left in your magazine when you quick reload, you will lose that. It just gets dumped, it gets emptied and you lose out on that ammo. And so that's what a speed reload does. And this is extremely useful in situations where you're shooting a guy, you're shooting a guy, and you need to quickly reload around a corner. You will sacrifice that those bullets, but you will get a faster reload. And of course, that's, you know, that's the takeaway there. It's a sacrifice kind of thing. So you guys may be wondering, how much faster is the speed reload? And the quick answer to that is I, done, I did a ton of testing outside of this video with actual precise numbers and time code and all of that. And there is no just base you know, value for how much faster the speed reel it is because it depends on which weapon you are using. So if I go through here and show you guys the weapon with the best speed reload difference that I tested was the ASM-1. So if I go in here in the firing range with the ASM-1 and I shoot it, normal reload is this quick and speed reload is that quick. You can tell it's a lot faster. It's 30% faster. But if I go back and choose the AK-12, which is what I showed you guys at the beginning of this video and do it, here's normal reload, here's speed reload. It's a little bit faster, but not that much faster. It's only 10% faster. So really the main takeaway here is that speed reload is between approximately 10 and 30% faster, depending on the gun that you're using. And some other things to note is that certain weapons don't even work. The ARX-160, the speed reload does not make a difference whatsoever. It's not faster. I don't know if that's a glitch or not, but I tested it and it's just not faster. And for some weapons, you just can't speed reload at all because of how the weapon works. So the Morse Sniper, this doesn't work because it's bolt action and you put a bullet in every time. It's impossible to speed reload. And weapons like the EM-1, this doesn't have ammunition, so it doesn't work. And the XMG is another example, just like the ARX-160 assault rifle. This just doesn't benefit from speed reload for whatever reason, I'm not even sure. So anyways, guys, that's all I have for you all today. And I hope you learned something new from this video. And if you did, remember to hit that like button. I'd really appreciate it. Also, don't forget you can subscribe to this channel for more advanced warfare multiplayer tips and tricks content daily. Talk to you guys next time. Peace.